guys so welcome to another episode of mass species my environment and today i'll be taking you through the process of bed ringing don't forget the last time we talked about bed capturing but today is the second phase of the bed capturing which is bed ringing stay tuned as we journey through the process so welcome back to my channel so bed ringing involves catching beds and securing a metal ring around one of their legs and ideally recording the bed species, age, sex, wing length, tail length, their weights, among others. Now each ring have a reference code inscribed on them that allows each particular bed to be uniquely identified if catch in the future. So I'm going to take you through a few processes as we learn together. I hope you stay tuned and enjoy the video. Let's see what we have in the field. Bats are the most widely used device for keeping birds safe. And this is because they are usually made of a soft materials and are of different sizes. So before ringing birds, we locate the birds and gently bring them out of their bag while keeping them safe. During the ringing process, we actually make use of different devices from the rulers, which is used to measure the wing length and the tail length. We also have a book which is used to record the data. The rings have a reference code inscribed on them and comes in different sizes depending on the size of the bird's legs. This allows each bird to be uniquely identified in the future. We also have our field identification book that enables us to identify each bird species while on field. Overlap it, so I do it by hand, but yeah, also use the pliers to round it nicely. So, now I'll turn this to one. So, I'm just rounding it, but I'm watching that I don't go too far. It should be quite a bit so it doesn't come off. No, that won't come off. Yeah, it's fine now. And now we try to identify the sex of the bird. That's a young male. Yeah. <laughs> and, and he passed for a few months. Now the young birds look like the female, but then the males will molt into the male female. Mm -hmm. And it's time to take the wing measurements. Detail measurement. We also try to check for molting in birds. 
This is to check the feather's development stage. Please don't forget to like my videos and subscribe to my channel to receive notification in the future. I hope to provide more explanation on the molting process in the We also try to see if there is any brood patch on them. The brood patch is usually on their abdomen and is used to apply it to the eggs during incubation. This is an indication that the bird is in their nesting season. We also record the bed weight, which is recorded in the data book. Lastly, we take pictures of the birds, including videos. The bird gets too comfortable sometimes that they don't just want to leave anymore. I hope you enjoyed these videos and I hope this makes you happy and you learned one or two things today. Please, if you love my videos as a way to support me, don't forget to like, subscribe and also turn on the notification button. Thank you and see you some other time. Cheers! Bye-bye!